So in order to build this wheel, I need a flat level surface, 10 foot by 10 foot. I don't have that, but I do have an uneven driveway. So all these square brackets that I hauled out of a dumpster are getting put in and measured off that center point with a six foot level. Those brackets are going to be welded to the angle iron. The angle iron is screwed into the concrete driveway. So I can get it level, clamped, and welded. The tough part is getting this black guy level across here and then getting the whole thing level to the center point. And the center point is level amongst itself. You can see these bolts I welded on. And this little plate up here I got level before welded that in place. So everything's measured off at this point. More specifically, everything's measured off that little drilled hole right there. So this is the first one and everything looks good and I'm about ready to weld this one. So I just got this uh, 5 8 thick 44 inch by 44 inch steel plate in place. You can see the little angle iron and inch and a quarter bolts, um, little screw jacks so that I can get this level with the center point. Uh, three more braces welded in, but I still have a bunch more around the rest of the circle to weld in. But we're getting there. So now I have all the brackets leveled in. They were all measured across the center hub to the support bracket. Angle iron screwed in, leveled, and then welded into place. Now, because they're all measured off this center point, they all should be fairly accurate with each other. So the real test is how accurate are they amongst themselves now that everything's done. This is a piece of cardstock. Uh, everyone recognizes millimeters as being small, so I'll just do that for everyone. It is about 0.2 millimeters. So we've got this used as a straight edge right across here. Nice and tight. Doesn't fit underneath. It's 
So we have a, definitely have a flat surface. And according to the bubble, it is level. And I checked most of these across there and they're all about the same. And actually over there, you can put the level across four points. And it's tied against four points. So I wasn't sure how accurate it was going to be setting up this way, but I'm pretty confident I got a flat level surface to fabricate this wheel on. And uh, start on that Monday. Uh, but uh, that's it for uh, this week.